Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to show you two new water marble designs. As you can see, this is what I ended up with and I really like how they turned out. So for the first one, I used a blue sheer polish with a silver polish. And as you can see, because the blue polish is sheer, you can sort of see through to the background color. And all these polishes that I use in the video will be in the description box down below in case you want to duplicate the exact same look. For this second design, I used a kind of a shimmer polish, actually iridescent topper polish with a purple polish to create this really delicate kind of petal-like shape. And as you can see, I really love how this turned out. And some of the areas are a little bit um, faded and uh, I intended it to be that way. And this one especially almost has a kind of a watercolor kind of effect. Um, if you look at it at the lower right hand corner. So I really love how this turned out. And um, after I let this dry from the water marble, I went ahead and used the same iridescent top coat that I used in the water marble to go ahead and make the white areas just a little bit more shinier, kind of a little bit reflects um, blue so that it looks even more amazing. So I really love how this turned out and I think these two designs are just super delicate and pretty. And uh, if you want to learn how to do these designs, just go ahead and keep watching. Let's go ahead and build the bullseye. This is going to be abstract design. So I'm just going to go ahead and do some random lines. I'm going to go ahead and take my fake nail and just aim for this portion of the design right here and go ahead and dip down. As always, clean up the surface of the water before taking out the nail. And let me just go ahead and show you this design. Just look at it. It produces this really beautiful kind of uh, almost fairy-like design. And because the blue I'm using is actually a very sheer blue, so some of the areas you can easily see through to the base color, which I absolutely love. So this is one way to use water marble to create a really gorgeous background. Or actually you can just wear this by itself. Let's go ahead and get started with the bullseye. So first we want to go from the center to the edge of the cup to kind of spread out that purple a little bit. And then what we want to do is actually shrink down the area that has purple. So we do this by using the toothpick and then I'm just going to run it along where the purple is at. And as you can see that kind of just decreased the intensity of the purple. We don't want a lot of purple in this design because we're kind of going for this uh, sort of light dreamy effect and also like abstract. So that's why we want to go ahead and uh, shrink down the area of the purple. Go ahead and take the nail and just aim for this part of the design and just go ahead and dip down. Before taking out the nail, always clean up the surface. And here is our design. 